I have a visual impairment, so that means that I need to obviously get around with a guide dog, Bess, who's down here. Um, she, she assists me to get to and from work and around the office. Most days depression doesn't affect me at all. Other days uh, it's just a feeling of, of sadness welling up inside me that I can't explain and that I struggle to control. I'm deaf in my left ear, to totally deaf, there's no, no hearing at all. Uh, in terms of day-to-day -day impact, um, the, the, it's mainly when I'm around uh, in big um, rooms or with lots of people talking, um, talking at once. In autism, a very fundamental aspect of it is sensory issues and that leads to a lot of your behaviour being about trying to control your sensory environment. There's a huge range of talent and resources out there that we can get access to and you know if you slightly modify the way you uh, interact with with person and the work environment it brings a huge amount of uh, different dimensions to the team. Marion's performance uh, even with a disability is exceptional. She is one of if not the best team assistants that I've ever come across and the quality of her work, her attention to detail, her accuracy is incredible. The main accommodations, the actual things that have been set up for me are shorter working hours, a later start, because for me it can be a problem sort of getting in and out during rush hour and just dealing with all the people. There's a misconception, particularly about depression, is that you know you don't enjoy life or that uh, you can't be in a high pressure job. Um, I do both. One of the misconceptions is that they, they act as if we can't speak for ourselves or can't hear them. I've made a lot of good friends through work and that's what work has given to me um, and that's a really important thing. That and having a purpose through meaningful work um, and that's a lot of the reason why I've stayed at NAB for two decades. The interesting, I think, learning for all of us is it, it doesn't really mean that much. <laughs> at the end of the day it's about who Marion is and what she does and what contribution she makes to the team, her performance. We don't look at Marion with having it, as having a disability at all. Anything that makes NAB more accessible for our customers makes it more accessible for our employees. Clearly at NAB we, we value diversity and as, a, as an employer you know, we want to be able to ensure that we, we do get the best of the workforce that we have so if we don't slightly modify things we're going to miss out on some real opportunities and I think it's the right thing to do and it plays the heart of our values as a bank.